No, no, it's in the air. Oh my god, was that you? No. Okay. Oh my god, I can't see James. Sorry mate, it's like... <sighs> okay. Welcome back YouTube to my channel. If you didn't see my last video, go check it out. Um, I did it at the Leisure Centre and it was awesome. Now since I've started YouTube, this is the challenge I've most been looking forward to because Berry Pomeroy Castle is the most haunted castle in the whole of the UK. Before we go to the castle and meet my brother, because he's joining me there, um, we're going to go to the shop because we're going to get hungry, we're going to get thirsty. Let's do this. Welcome back. So I just driven down to Barry Pomeroy, which is just over there. I met my brother who's in this car. Uh, so what we're going to do now is we're going to buy a ticket and then we're going to kind of explore the place, get an idea on how we're going to get in, how we're going to escape if it all goes wrong. And then, yeah, I'll bring you back once we're in there. Yeah. yeah. We just brought our ticket and what we're going to do is we're just going to go explore. Here's the entrance. Uh, welcome inside. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be sick. Come on, we won't be coming this way later. No. <laughs> right, okay, so let's get our bearings. This is the wooden part. Mate, this place is scary already. So what we're doing right now, we're trying to find a wall to climb over when this place is closed. Um, my brother thought he found it, but it's not the right wall. But it's definitely here. I've, the thing is with these type of buildings, they're listed, so they can't add to them. So seven, eight years ago when I was jumping over this wall, I know that's still here and we've just got to find it. Looks pretty mad. Everything's so narrow, isn't it? Yeah. Look, what's this say? We definitely won't be climbing tonight. <laughs> definitely not. Whoa, this is mad. Oh my, that's not the dungeon, is it? That's not the dungeon. Should we go down? I'm scared already, man. It's not even night time. No, this is the 
this is a bit dodgy. This may be one of them, but this isn't the same one as Tower. Let's see if I can do that. This is the end. Hang on a second. I think this might be St. Margaret's fucking tower here. Starved to death by her sister Eleanor. This this is where it took place. This is actually it. So obviously when we're here at night, this is gonna be creepy. Oh my god, it feels horrible down here. Oh my god, straight away, can you feel that? Yeah. It's cold, isn't it? Oh, fuck, it's cold down here, man. There's even bars in the window, so you can't even get out. Uh, I'm naturally cold down here. Yeah, there's definitely a vibe. My, my GoPro's just turned off by itself, and it's never done that before, as soon as we've walked down here. So this is the dungeon here, isn't it? This is it, this is St. Margaret's Tower here. So we think this might be the wall. Uh, Sean's just going to check it out to see if there's something on the other side. Okay, so it's not that wall. On to the next. Oh, that's a dead end. This is another little room. Still struggling to find an exit and an entrance, but we're getting there. We're getting there. I don't think I've showed you this bit yet, but honestly, the atmosphere in this place is 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 incredible. There's an energy here. There's definitely some sort of weird energy going on. So yeah, the search continues. So I think my brother's just found a wall. That is doable. Yeah, so basically we're gonna, at night, we're gonna come through this way. Yeah. And then basically we are in. Straight across towards the dungeon. Certainly the dungeon will be over there. If before it's dark, do you wanna have a walk around the outside of the perimeter so we know where we're going, so we're not doing it pitch black first? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Yeah. We'll do that. We'll do that. Don't wanna uh, surprise ourselves in the dark, do we? No. So after having a discussion, we've actually decided that this is the best way because it's, although they put these bars up to stop people, they're actually quite good handholds. So, you know, it's the safest way and it's the best way. And, you know, it's just a straight direction to where we need to be as well. So. Yeah, definitely. I mean, all the reports of uh, mysterious things happening kind of start at this bridge and end at this bridge. So as long as we stay this side, the theory is, even if we have to run, we can, this is our, this is our camp zero. Yeah, this is, this is our go. safe spot. This is our safe zone. <laughs> this is apparently, you know, yeah. later on when we're both fighting each other to get over the wall first, yeah. <laughs> it'll be a bit different maybe. Uh, hey. Is that for the way home, mate? Just yeah. going to get cut short. Yeah. Yeah. You might need a bigger bottle. Yeah, I might need Have you had fun? You don't see that in London, do you? Let's get out of it before they shoot us. <laughs> Silly boys. <laughs> It's 10 to 4 and the castle closes at 4 p.m. So we're getting our stuff ready um, stuff ready now and then we're going to go hide somewhere because they actually close all the gates and we don't want them knocking on our cars telling us that we've got to move on. So if we're not in the, in the car, they can't physically move us. Welcome back. So this place is officially closed and actually they're trying to find us because we're not supposed to be in here and our cars are left in the car park. So they've been shouting at us that they're closing the gates. Um, so we're just laying low at the moment until they've cleared. Um, so yeah, I'll bring you back soon. It's five o'clock and me and my brother were hiding um, and the owners were shouting, you need to move your car, you need to move your car. Um, you know, this is your last warning, we're closing the gates. So what we decided to do is actually go in the cars and drive somewhere else out of the uh, premises. Um, we asked a lady what would have happened and she said she would have called the police. What we're going to do, we're going to wait until it's a little bit later, we're just going to relax and then we're going to drive back to the castle and then we're just going to hop over the gate. 
Welcome back, it's 8pm and uh, we're still sat outside in the middle of nowhere. We've actually just had some neighbours come up to us and, and see if we're alright because it looks a little bit suspicious that we're just parked outside their house. Um, so yeah, in a minute we're going to drive to Barry Pomeroy and then jump over the gates. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited for that. I guess the main thing and the main question a lot of you are probably thinking is do we actually believe in ghosts and um, are we actually going to see anything? So if I pass over to you... The What's thing, your view? Do you believe in it? This is this is what's been running through my head all day actually. No matter when we was hiding from the people that look after the castle, when I was driving here initially yesterday, a week ago when we actually planned this trip, uh, the whole time the the one question running through my head was do I believe? Am I scared? Am yeah. I scared? If if I'm scared, surely I believe a little bit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um this is why am I scared? Uh cuz I'd always get this feeling of maybe there's something else. And the fact that Berry Pomeroy Castle is one of the most, if not the most haunted yeah, castle yeah. in England. I'm scared, mate. Yeah. You know, like, if you're going to see a ghost, yeah, it's gonna if be you're going to be punched in the face by a ghost, if you're going to be pushed down the stairs by a poltergeist, it's going to be here, yeah. right? Yeah. And as a sceptic, you know, like I said earlier, I've got one foot in, I've got one foot out. Yeah. I'm scared because I kind of, I, I kind of, there's something in me that wants to believe. Yeah. I think yeah. if I see something tonight or the camera picks up something tonight that is That's undeniable it, concrete evidence that there is ghosts, that makes me believe that I'm not going to die at the age of 70. I'm going to just live on. And, yeah. Well, it'd be re reassurance um, out of being scared. It'll it? be reassurance <laughs> out of pure fear. Yeah. Will I allow my fear? Will we allow our fear? to take over. Will we hear things that aren't really there? Will we see things that aren't really yeah, there? Is it in our mind? Is it in our mind? Yeah. We're going to have a dance down in the St. Margaret's Tower, are we? Are we going to have a dance? <laughs> okay, so I wanted to do a little bit of a joke scene and, and have a dance, but now it's come to the time. Like, <laughs> I'm a little bit scared and I'm like, if there is something real, I don't want to upset them. Exactly. So but, now I'm now I'm even more scared for dancing. The amount of people that have gone yeah. down there and said, Margaret, are you here? Are you here? And tried to do this ghost thing. We've gone down there, had a boogie. She might just think, yes. Let's join in. This is what I've been missing. Join in. This is it. Yeah. This is it. What music we're boom boom. <laughs> hey, hey. Um, but I can't promise I'm not gonna run. Because I will capture something <laughs> if there is there, and I'm off. Like I'm not, you know what I mean? <laughs> You're gonna leave me. I'm not shaking anyone's hand. Man, I need I'm not going to leave you, but I'm hand. just saying that if no, it goes yeah. tits up, let's both get out of there. Well, wait, 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 wait. we got to get some footage first. Yeah. Oh, yeah. A couple of people, a couple of people been moaning, oh, James, like, you need to get a bigger torch. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, I, this is my torch. Is that yeah. what you was using? Yeah. Oh, no wonder they fucking complain. Look at the size of it. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is this bright enough for you? I hope so. So, um, yeah, we'll see you soon. Yeah. Right, we're at the entrance now, so we're just going to have a look around and suss out where we need to be. It's pouring down with rain, so. Uh... Okay, so what we've decided is actually the weather is appalling. Uh, we're prepared for it to be this bad all night, but right now we've just found the way to the entrance. We kind of know where we're going. Uh, we got caught out by a couple of people a minute ago and we had to literally hide in the rain for 15, 20 minutes so we're damp. So we've decided the best uh, plan of action is gonna be, let's go back to the car, let's make a plan that is solid. Uh, we didn't plan for these eventualities so let's go back to the car, make a plan that's solid, let's get prepared properly, let's come back and let's do this challenge. Let's go down St. Margaret's Tower and let's have it. All right, guys, we're back in the car. We're just waiting until the rain stops a little bit and then we're going to head back down to the castle and we're going to have a proper explore. Um, I'm super nervous but excited. So I'm currently having lunch, which is... Got some Coke. Got some Doritos, Yorkie and chicken and bacon. So as I'm eating my dinner, not lunch, um, I'm also listening to my brother play guitar. 
so got a bit of music, got a bit of food. I'm actually quite warm and uh, just gonna chill here. Be as soon you can illuminate the moon. Yo. I know storms come with me in the middle I give a little fiddle to tickle the main ripple You say you make floods but it's more like a trickle Say you talk clear but it's more like a riddle So stop, ain't in opposition to drop Say you talk black and when you talk to the cops you're hot You see me in a difficult spot I should I leave you or put you in the river to rot Should I make where you let you carry on with your life And let you think about the time you had a date with a knife Weren't over drugs and it weren't over money You thought you could bully me, you thought it was funny I put you in the dark when you thought it was sunny Don't look so hard now you crying for your mummy This true, got six years for my crime But revenge was worth six years once upon a Time. It wasn't right, so we both run for our lives. Yeah, not afraid to admit we both run for our lives. Yeah, yeah, every time, and I say, Now we're scared, now we don't know what to do. Woo. But I know I got you. It's um, it's five past one, and um, we're about to walk down now back to the castle. And this time, there's no checking it out. Uh, we're going straight over that wall, and we're exploring. Uh, I think we've been putting it off a little bit. Yeah. We're both a little bit scared and just quite comfortable in the car. Yeah. All right, we're heading up to the entrance point of the castle, um, and we're gonna do it. It's, uh, that time has come. Yeah, you brave up. You go home. Watch out for this tree branch, mate. Here's the wall. Ah. <sighs> okay. Oh, to hell. So, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good, I'm feeling positive that we we're here. You've got to be careful because this is actually quite slippery. Yeah. So we just need to be a bit careful because well, you, you need to make sure you've got a good grip on them bars. Yeah, yeah. And upper body strength. <clears throat> and obviously the drop on the other side. Okay. Who's doing it first? Me? Hey. You on? Easy. What does that feel? Oh, there you go. It's a bit slippery, but you've got the grip. You've got the grip. Wow, it is slippery. You see the strong hands. Oh, shit. Oh. It's alright. It's alright, it's alright. Yeah. It's alright. It's got a good hand on the foot. Yeah, it was. It was the foot. Just pull with the bars. Just so let's get a foothold. That's it, 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 that's
and this is where they would have wined and dined. This is where they would have had their all of their yep, yep, family right. get-togethers. And straight opposite is where Margaret was starved to death by her sister, almost like they could keep an eye on her. Right, it just it's her it's just right in here. So everyone's out here having a good time, and you can tell this is where they met, because this is the only big fireplace in the place. This is yeah. where people are going to gather around. And uh, they must have had so many good Christmases and everything here, but just over there, just opposite, just up the stairs, was the screams of agony, the pain that All must right, have echoed through this let's building. Let's do it. Come on. <sighs> We're going. Oh, God. The rain just makes it worse. Yep. I feel an energy change straight away. I feel this feels weird. This is um. I feel emotional. I seriously feel emotional. My heart's fucking racing. It's just that the feeling about that window. No, honestly, I feel emotional. I feel like I'm gonna. So this is where it all happened, and you know, if she is here, I'm sorry. I'm sorry it happened to you. No, that weren't nice, you know? And, uh, you know, we're here giving our respects, really. Um, it's... I thought I'd say it did. It's, it's uh, different from how I thought I was going to feel, actually. I felt emotional, and I yeah. still feel like, no, it's weird. There is a, there is a, there is a feeling of sympathy and yeah. peace, yeah. No, like, yeah, I know, I keep hearing noises. I keep hearing little things. Yeah, I keep hearing it's your stomach or something, but it's... No. Do you know what? I felt most welcome down here than I did have out throughout the rest yeah. of the castle. Yeah, yeah, which is weird, because it's like you're, you're welcomed here. That, that chill's weird. That doesn't feel... That's what happened earlier when your GoPro... Yeah, I know, off, yeah. I don't know if you caught... I wasn't clear, guys, but we were down here earlier, and my GoPro actually turned off and did something I've never seen it do. Um, and I've had it for four months now. Without you guys, we couldn't be doing this. Yeah. And without us, you couldn't be experiencing this now. Yeah, definitely. If this was me locked down here, being starved to death, yeah, and this was felt uneasy then. I mean, I feel really uneasy at the moment, mate. Don't know. Sorry, guys. I think the energy's changing in here. Yeah. If we're out staying well. Yeah. Seriously, I've got I, a bag. I, I can feel that. I've got a uh, uh, Guys, I Wait, feel like I can't panic, breathe. Panic, no, panic. I just feel like I can't oh, breathe, oh, mate. All oh, oh, my hair's on the back of my head standing mate, up. Mate, I can't, I can't fucking breathe at the moment, mate. I've got emotional, get. We need to get out of here. <sighs> God, let's go over here. Let's get out of there for a minute. Sorry, I... It's like, it's, it's, oh it God, gets you. She was fucking there, I'm telling you. She doesn't come out here, does she? No. Right, where should we go? I feel a bit disoriented. My neck was fucking Sorry, mate, I freaked. Something, something like I came up near my I shoulder. It. I felt it on the back of my neck. Let's like go out there. Me out. Okay, let's just get away from this. It's this energy. So I had I had to get out of there. I'm really sorry. Uh, we'll go back in, but something <laughs> emotional just came over me. And I felt this really weird crash on my right, right shoulder. That was pushing me to them stairs. And um, yeah. I got emotional again, and I, I don't know. And now I'm out, I feel a bit, bit safer, but like we're in someone's house, that's how it feels. Yeah, and, and, and uh, it's felt like we outstayed our welcome, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's like, hang on, like you're, you're in my area. And we both felt at the same time, it yeah, was like so, something so changed, we just had to leave. We're gonna stay here, but we're, we're just gonna oh, just feel God. safe for a minute, yeah, and then we'll, yeah. we'll carry on. Yeah. The atmosphere has changed for me, mate. Yeah, it's definitely... I feel like yeah, there's definitely... Can we stay away from that area? I feel like in here. Yeah, same. I feel like we're safer in here. So if we just look around... I mean, there is a claustrophobic feel to this place. There's, there's and it kind is, of no way out. Yeah. Like, and actually, the way out for us is a slippery, dangerous one. So we've got to be careful. We don't, we have to make sure that we you know, we need to be on the board. <sighs> okay. 
footsteps, it's probably just rain. Ignore it. Let's just walk over here to the bridge, maybe. I mean, I just feel, I don't know, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? Um, honestly... Like, I'm feeling all this weird, sh like, towards that corner. Mm. There's something, I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, because I'm in this place. I think, my, I think my legs are naturally taking me away from yeah. the tower. Yeah, I just don't know if I'm paranoid. <sighs> okay, are we ready, mate? Getting back up the stairs, they're so steep. It just feels like there's a dragon waiting down there. We've right. got positive energy though, haven't we? Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Come on, mate. Let's do it. Right, if I get emotional, I'm sorry, but... One last time for the road. Famous last words. Oh, my God. That breeze. Oh, that, can, can you hear that? Don't leave me on the stairs, because I don't feel easy here. I don't know if we should. I feel alright, I think. I think she lets you know when she knows when you're in here. Yeah. We know that from before. Do you know what? I've had the urge, Margaret, I'm going to sit down. I had the urge to do this before, I'm not disrespecting you. But I just want to take a second. Because if she scares the hell out of me like she's done before, then... I'm just trying to, I'm trying to feel... No, we're right behind, we're sat right mm -hmm. there. And it's all coming from this window here. I don't know whether this is the window she used to cry out for the... Oh, I don't, don't, I don't, know whether... I don't want to upset her. Something doesn't want us in there. What the fuck was that? I don't know. Don't in those footsteps. Okay, just, 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 care, just slowly. Right, slowly, slowly. Let's just get out of here. So fucking sorry, sorry. sorry. There's fucking footsteps outside that window, and that is in the air. Oh my god, was that you? No. Okay. Oh my god, I can't see James. Sorry, mate. It's like. Something... Okay, just gently, 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 gently. Did you hear that? Yeah. Was oh, that me? Yeah. No, was I, that wasn't was that you? No, no. What I'm saying was that oh, was that me that just heard that? No, yeah. I heard that. That chain, that metal. I don't know. So yeah, we we've done it. We've been in. We've explored. Um, I think both me and my brother have. We're not comfortable. Um, and we've really enjoyed it here. So it's time to get out. It is time. Like it. It's time to get out, mate. Keep it on. Someone's got. Careful. To Go. Wait, I'm going for it. Right, you ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Oh. Well, now he's covered in mud. Uh. Right, I'm going to drop you the torch. Ready? Yeah. Okay. If I break an ankle, mate. Oh, shit. It's alright, you got to hang. Hang. You're only about four foot off the ground. Uh. That's it, that's it, that's it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we've done it. Right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. What we're going to do now is we're just going to have a bit of downtime. We're going to yeah. organise the bedroom back there. It's a bit of a mess. Um, and boys then, will yeah. be boys. And then we're going to yeah. get some sleep with the doors locked. Good morning. Um, we made it through the night in the car and it was relatively nice and warm. Um, it would have been too cold to stay in that dungeon um, and it didn't feel right. Plus when we got out to sleep in the car, um, there was loads of people banging on our car and messing around, obviously trying to prank us. Um, so so yeah, what we're going to do now is you have a look. This is where we stayed. Welcome back YouTubers. I'm back at home now um, after a long but exciting night. Um, there was so much that happened when we we're in the dungeon. My camera kept turning off. It was very strange. And I felt really strange. I felt really emotional. And then we started hearing noises. I spoke to my brother and he actually felt something on his neck. Um, but we didn't capture actual, like, 
footage of her um, on camera, which I'm gutted about because um, I really wanted this trip to be the turning point on if I believe in ghosts or not. And I'm still not sure. I just still don't know. Um, when we were trying to sleep, we were getting pranked. People were banging on our car, making noises. Uh, and I got really freaked out by that, I'm not going to lie. So we made a decision just to drive away from the castle, park anywhere, luckily which was near my brother's car, and then we just rested there. So uh, it worked itself out, but it was so freaky. Hit the um, like button if you enjoyed watching, and subscribe to my channel for more videos, because I've got loads more coming up. See you soon, and take care.